Welcome everybody, Envy here with another God of War regular rock video. In the last episode, we ended up uh, defeating, what is it, Gamner? Garm? Garm, the wolf. But we actually ended up taking it over with Fenrir's soul. <laughs> it was a very emotional episode. I was like, <gasps> no, the little wolf, little puppy. That's a tear, meditating. I was like, no, that little puppy. But then it was a happy ending. So now we're going to actually go hop out Freya. Hey, wait. We're with you. Let's go then. Now here we go. Be sure to grab a snack, a cup of water, and let's do this. Check on Freya. Last time you were in ben Still don't know how you got Freya to stop trying to kill you. We traveled to her village to break Odin's spell. Once freed, she accepted that I was not her enemy. You also missed a highly entertaining moment where Brock was lifted ass over face in Freya's camp. Isn't that Freya? What's he like? Different from his sister. Lacks of conviction. True. And he's a bit quicker to forgive. And an ineffective leader. But his heart's in the right place. You'll like him, lad. And an effective leader. <laughs> wow. It's beautiful. And, uh, what? It is also dangerous. More dangerous than hell? Hey, is that soundstone on that log? I could get us past it. We'll do it later, but we're just gonna break it for now. There we go. Freya's camp is to the right. No rush is that. Not every day the lad gets to see a new realm. Barricade wasn't there last time. Fair's group has been busy. So where to now? This way, I guess. <clears throat> to Fair's camp then. Time to see how the Vanier have fared in our absence. I hope Freya's okay. She can care for herself. We're still checking on her, though? Her brother's forces are outnumbered. And there is much I owe her. I did I miss it? <laughs> Reminds me of a Vanaheim song I heard long ago. Whoa, an 
moved your soul seed to Muspelheim. Think it might lead to that combat arena we visited years ago? Maybe. No one here. Where is everyone? Stay alert. I don't like this, brother. There was him, though. Kratos, Atreus, a welcome reunion. Unexpected, but welcome. You know us? Can't be. Is that who I think? Oh, you shifty bastard. It's almost good to see you again. And for once in the shape of a man, or nearly. So that's how they got your head out of your ass. Maybe now you'll stop being such a half-blind, piss-drunk, oversexed liar. He was more of a pig than I ever was. I do not know you. <laughs> do you not recognize your handiwork? Hildis Vini. Remember when we first met Frey in the woods? After I... Oh. I am so, so sorry about that. Freya's poor. Her advisor. And friend. Counselor to the Vanir. And yes, while exiled at Midgard, I was trapped in my boar form. And then you shot me. At my command. No. My arrow, my mistake. Forgotten. Vanaheim needs our help more than ever. Even Mimir's. Come. <laughs> Just watch where you aim that bow of yours. My hide's not so thick in this form. <laughs> we can head out whenever you're ready. Where are we going? I have a favor to ask. I'll explain on the way. Where's Freya? She came here to help her brother. She leads the search party for Freya and Bigvir. They've been captured by the Ainher Yard. Hey, that happened. An ambush. The presence has intensified since your last visit. To make matters worse, the Celestial Wolves haven't been seen in days. Or at least I assume. Not easy, tracking time with no moon in the sky. No moon. Just like in their shrine. Their shrine? It's a long story. You want us to check on them? You would have my gratitude. We're spread thin. And if anyone can help Skull and Hati, you don't disappoint. Continue down this path and you'll find their den. Good luck. And don't oh. shoot any boars. <laughs> you think he's only for getting me for shooting him? Trust me, lad. The old swine still carried a grudge. You'd know it. What happened between you two? The usual. Miscommunication, conflicting loyalties, broken promises. Nothing to concern yourself with. I'm not concerned. Just curious. Curiosity's mm -hmm. all well and good. But so is privacy, huh? Okay, okay. Point taken. Who these people are? Oh, it's one of the wolves. Oh, uh, both of the wolves. Hello? I think they're sleeping. Well, there you have it. The legendary celestial wolves. Supremely entertaining, as promised. Remember their shrine? They didn't rejoin the sky until after the moon returned. And then chased an arrow across the sky. Right. Well, guess we go find the moon and put it back where it belongs, eh? As if that's a perfectly normal thing to say. Recover the stolen bone. Part according to Skolanati Shrine. Managed to stuff the moon inside a box, if memory serves. But it didn't say where they took the box. Aye. That's the rub of using prophecy as a map, isn't it? A bit sparse on the details. There's a war camp in the nearby village. A strong fortress to guard their bounty. We will try there first. Besides Hildesvini and the 
Not much army, really. Although Beer Girl was a soldier, once walking the path of a traveler. I imagine he's handy with that enormous broken sword of his. A traveler that doesn't want to kill us. That's nice. Ready to put the moon back where it belongs? Okay. Let's yeah. do it. That is a weird thing to say. Hey! Hurry! She's getting away! Come on! It's cold. Is this? It's from Elheim. Heimd almost to grab this while I freed Garm. Uh, I was there, but I, I didn't know. And now you fight to undo the damage. Your guilt is misplaced. Yeah. No, you, you're right. Here goes nothing. Do it. Just like inside their shrine. If I do this... Fate only binds you if you let it. Do what is necessary. Not because it is written. Good choice, lad. Alta. They have a gift for us. A way to call them anytime we need them. Little flute? What is this? A glow stick? Remember that altar we saw when we first got here? I think that's where we're supposed to use it. Who's that? Ah, that wrinkly mud belongs to Helka. She's a blossunder. Hounds prized for their pinpoint accurate tracking abilities. You'll love her. Love her. Kratos, Atreus. That eclipse was your doing, I take it. Thank you for coming. Big Vir used the diversion to escape. What about your brother? We know where they're holding him now. Bale has already prepped the explosives. If you're with me, we can leave as soon as you're ready. Let's go. Help. Go with him, Atreus. I will aid Freya. Yes, sir. The fuse is but 30 heartbeats. That's enough. Once you see the signal, count it down. Let's go, Freya. The wolves gave us a scepter. They will answer, should we call on them. Good. There's a shortcut to Niord's temple we can use in daylight. The Einherjar are holding fear in your father's own temple. It's been empty for as long as I can remember. There's a celestial altar across the river. According to Bigfear, the altars were once used to signal the wolves. And now we have just the scepter to do it. 
What is your plan? When we reach the temple, I'll fire off the beacon. A signal for Bela and Birger to set off their distraction. The Dark Elf Hive. Nice to not be on the receiving end of it for once. With their attention drawn elsewhere, you and I can assault the main force from behind. While Atreus and Hildesvini slip in to rescue your brother in the confusion. Yes. Once we see their beacon, we'll regroup by the river and escape on Freyr's boat. Good! That's the way! Try dragging the scepter across the belly. of the giants. Atreus believes Ragnarok is inevitable. The Norns were quite clear on the nature of prophecy. They told us that some of our choices were predictable. But we have changed. Alas, we're Neithog. It was in our way. I, I don't doubt it. Curious, though. What was she doing here? Odin used roots of the World Tree as part of his spell that kept me from leaving Midgar. Neithho protects the tree's roots, wherever they are. Ah, I see. Odin used her. And she unwittingly paid the price. Classic Odin. <laughs> Call on Skull, please. Are you ready? I am. Are you? I'm not leaving here without my brother. Are we ready? Yes, we are. Let's go. We're coming for you, Ingvi. Damn. Completely giving away your position. <laughs> what idiots. Oh. If it isn't Queen Mistletoe herself. Hilarious, by the way. Been a while. I'm done. <laughs> and you must be the little half-breed's father. Lucky day! <laughs> you have a lot to answer for, Sunshine. You too, Trent. Better a traitor than Odin's lapdog. Mm. <laughs> the burden is mine. I can help. I know. But you are needed elsewhere. He's right, you know. Sizzles wasn't looking so hot last I saw. I know you didn't want this, but we know how this ends. See you soon. Well, we both know that's not true. <laughs> but don't worry, Frigg. I'll be coming for you and your brother as soon as I am finished here. Now, what you got? Oh, have to buy from on me. Oh, so messy. So angry. Not going to lie. I'm disappointed. Having fun yet? Well, you and me then. Oh wait, you expected the I can 
can feel your frustration. It is immensely satisfying. What now, brother? The spear remains our best chance. Hey, careful! These are new braces. Actually hit me! Slow down! I don't remember the last time anyone hit me! When was the last time I gave it you? That's right. Wait. What is going on in that empty little head? Oh, no, 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 no. You are going to spare me out of pity. Let it go, and you may live. Is this about the little runt? Oh, now I am definitely going to gut him. This is your final warning. I don't think a warning is going to cut it. You think you get to just walk away? No. That is not how this works. You do not get to decide my fate! You are dead, sunshine.
Damn. That's crazy. Damn. Just destroy the shadow. We're flying. <laughs> What's so funny? Seeing your faces. <laughs> Relax. What the hell? It's flying. We're flying. I knew it would do that. Smoothly. Uh, little help? Uh, 
Don't do it. It's gonna suicide. What a legend! the end of Birger. You think he survived that? He's down there picking the dirt out of his nails with the beast's feathers. We'll see. He... Uh, <laughs> he has to be. We're almost there, Ingrid. Just hold on a bit longer. I don't suppose I have much of a choice at the moment. And boiling water, red root and lamb's grass. I know, I know. You think I never staunched a bleeder before? Oh, now don't you go worrying, boss. I didn't go through any of your stuff while you was off being tortured. Ah, damn it, Linda! Easy. Heck, you says to me for? I ain't the one who stuck you like a damn pig. No offense. Freya, mind giving her a hand? We're just taking over entirely. Hold still. She'll just keep you safe so we can take you to Sindri's house. The rest of my groups are there. We'll protect the realm in your absence. The four of us. Vanaheim's in good hands. It's just four people. <laughs> oh, party at Sindri's house, then. Huh? Whoever that is. Your boat. Nope. Your boat. Go on. Take it. Sail the skies, sun yourself on its bow. You look like you could use it. <laughs> Make a Vanir god proud. Gave you his boat? Nice. He left me no choice. Because it was necessary, not because it was written. Exactly. Creatures of Prophecy completed. Prophecy holds Galahorn is the herald of Ragnarok. That orb, yeah. Whatever it does. Read about it in Lonely Holds Atreus. We will discuss in private. Well, I've been recording for quite a while now. So, hopefully, that's all we love. It's the dark elf and the white elf. If you want to thank him, don't get captured again. Honestly. I promise, love. Damn. Poor guy. He was a legend. <laughs> well, if you like my content, you're always welcome to hit the like button. If you're new around here, you're always welcome to subscribe. 
I do daily content on different types of games. Most of you right now is going to be God of War Ragnarok. And as always, this is Envy, signing out. See you in the next episode. I'll let them finish. Well, see you in the next time. Bye-bye.